the species doesn't fully mature until about the age of 10. At that point, he can reach up to 6,000 pounds. So he was born in the San Diego Zoo Safari Park. It's the location where we do all of our rhino breeding. Includes greater one horn rhinos like Sherratt, also white rhinos and black rhinos. And since the park opened in the 70s, we've been lucky enough to have 67 baby greater one horn rhinos. So that's the highest number of any facility. And it's really, really amazing because they have a 16 month gestation, so it takes a while to have a baby. We have two little ones out there right now, total of 10 greater one horn rhinos at the park. And they're in danger due to poaching for their horn. Some cultures believe their horn possesses medicinal value. The scientifically proven, his horn is just made out of keratin, the same stuff as your hair and fingernails. So with that theory, we can all eat our hair when we're sick and get better. But this does not occur. So if you could pass along, rhino horn is not medicine. That would be awesome. And in a moment, you're going to get to feed Surat and pet Surat. We'll feed first, and then after feeding, we'll pet down by the stairs over there.